Mr. We have no extended session, so what are we doing here? Spending is out of control. Groups like Americans for Prosperity don't think families need another tax increase. They think government should cut back. The amount of spending that this governor and the, Annap and the politicians in Annapolis have done in the last five, six years has put us on a path that is unsustainable. But O'Malley says cutting back isn't enough, and without a tax increase, the state would need to reduce spending by a half billion dollars. Uh, a cuts-only approach would help no one, and it would harm all of us. So O'Malley wants lawmakers to pass a tax hike for Marylanders who make more than $100,000 or families with a household income of more than $150,000. It's part of his overall budget plan that also increased fees like the flush tax for all households in the state, one of many that has critics and conservatives questioning the governor's record on taxes. People are struggling right now, ladies and gentlemen. If we take more money out of their pocket by increasing their income taxes, they're going to spend less money, and in this economy, that's going to mean less less revenue to the state, and it's going to be, mean a bigger hole going forward. The question is not whether to tax or not in Maryland. The question is how much we're going to tax. Uh, every problem we face, the answer is more taxes. And if taxes keep going up, some say Maryland could lose families, businesses, and jobs. There's going to be tax hikes not just on wealthy Marylanders, but on middle-class Marylanders, on working-class Marylanders, and eventually people are just going to get fed up and they're going to leave.